Good morning. Good morning and welcome back. Welcome back to Arcolics Anonymous. And welcome to the island. We're going to leave this island sitting right there. I don't think anything's going to mess with her. And we're going to jump out here at the berry and see if we can't find some trouble in the water. I think we're not going to have any problem because I've been waiting for daylight. I had to go shopping on Amazon while I was waiting. But before I like tabbed out of this, there was an alpha megalodon down here. Let's see if he's still here. That him over there? Yep, level 10. What's that guy? That's level 30. He's going to come over and join the fight. You know he will. That's okay. It's a max level something here. What about you? You're 100. You're 40. All right. Let's get this fight started. Hey, stop swimming away from me. We're going to fight, dude. It's not, that's not a way to fight. It's not how you fight. It's how you run like a bitch. You're making me waste my... Oh, you're getting down here where there's some Nidera. That's what you're doing, dick. We're going to kite you over here where there aren't. And we're going to whack you with our tail. And then chomp on you some. Come on, you're almost dead. All right, Alpha Kill Barry. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. We don't even really need to mess with these. We should just, like, kill them and move on. That's what we're looking for. It's a Bacillosaurus. And that's about it. And it's probably going to take us a while. So, here's what I'm going to do. You know what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause you until something interesting is going on. Oh, and just in case y'all are wondering why I brought the gas mask. Because that's what the ocean looks like with a gas mask. When you're in first person. Alright, I don't need to carry around all this crap. Not even anything here worth hanging on to. Just the meat. Anyway, this is what we're doing. So, we'll see y'all after a while. Okay, well, I've like swam... Well, you've seen where I started over there. So, I've swam all the way around to here. Most of the way around the fucking map. Just to find... A 140 female. So, it's not like it's half of max level about... So, we're going to go ahead and get it. As soon as I kill everything around me that's going to fucking bother me, of course. And... 
it would give us a good place to start because I'd much rather swim all the way around this ocean on a fucking back of a Bacillosaurus than on a Baryonyx. As much as I like my berries. Oh, I will so eat you, dude. Yeah, as much as I like my berries, they don't compare with the bassy. Hey, there's another one down there, isn't it? Hey, that's a male 120, so I could tame that son of a bitch, too. And have a 140 and a 120. I think I might. That way I can just swim around on an imprinted one. I don't know, though. They're kind of big. They clog up the water. Yeah, I know it's going to be a while. Anyway, I'll decide if I come across anything better. I'll bring you all back and let you know. Wait, there's another one. Oh, that's level 10. That one sucks ass. You know, the 120 and the 140 is not a bad pair. Oh, no. What are you... Didn't you be coming over here mooching off of my fucking Bacillosaurus? Here, come get mad at me. I hate manas. He won't even swim close enough for me to bite him. He don't want to aggro on me because he's a douchebag. Anyway, I'm going to pause y'all. No point in waiting on this crap. Ooh, peeled them off the side. I hope I did anyway. Yep, we're still taming. So we're good. We'll see y'all after a while. Hopefully I'll have something better to show you, like a max level something, something. Maybe not. But this is apparently a hot spot for spawning. Down here, this looks like Herbivore Island. So, we'll just visit here a few times. See if something better can spawn. We'll go kill that little 10, obviously. But I may go ahead and get to 120. I'm doubting it, though. I don't know. We'll see. See y'all after a while. Okay, my peoples, finally. After, like, killing a lot of Therizina's horse here. We got this girl. Right here. She is a 250. And I was fixing a shooter with crossbow bolts. Because I'm retarded. Okay, so she, anyway, she's a 250. And, I mean, that's not, that's not garbage. Where's my fucking harpoon launcher? There it is. Oh, I missed her. Damn it. The raptor here that wants to cause problems. Knew it. Be hitting my bird. continue to look for a max level of course but in the interim I mean uh, a 250 is not trash not by a long shot oh, there's another damn raptor one that didn't I kill you once there I got him for you little turtle buddy I 
So as long as this team goes well, we'll at least have an acceptable breeder. For the max level males we have. It's just like a whole handful of trouble right there wanting some bullshit going on. I will go down here and kill this one. Yeah, you're always looking for the better option, right? You know, even in games. So, we'll keep an eye out for a better option. But that's our best option so far. And she's not bad. And she's pretty. Which, I mean, that's just a win-win-win, isn't it? Hey, there's a Squatch. We ain't got a Squatch here. We need a Squatch. Come here, my dude. Come wander around over here for a while. Yeah, see, check out the scenery. Check out this canyon. This canyon looks pimp. You know you want it. What are you, what are you hitting my bird for? He didn't attack you. Just picked you up. Be a dick. I'm gonna kill you now. Instead, we're gonna do that. And then we're going to run down here and do this. Here, we need to get some more on there. Or maybe we'll give him one of these. And then just plenty more of those. We got plenty. My wife's on the other server now, so she can make some more if we need it. That's good looking squash too. He hit my bird one more time. I was going to fuck him up, though. I ain't going to lie. Because that's just rude. All we were doing was airlifting him. He had to take it all personal. Maybe he's going on a date or something, and I just messed with his agenda. He's wandering back over there. They look like I'm going to be late, baby. <laughs> Grabbing a chunk of wood, doing some tree knocks. Come on now. Turn around. I'm wandering back over there. There's an alpha over there. That's better. Wander back around that way. Look for some stuff in the bushes over there. It takes a long to tame this high-level crap. But it's worth it. Dude, he looked right at me and pooped, just like a dog. Oh, 
Come on, just hurry up and eat again, dude. Man, I fucking hate waiting on this passive crap. I'd rather just knock you out and leave you. Holy shit. See that Terrazine Zora just like spawn right in right there? I think we should put it to sleep. We'll kill it here in a minute. Right, how's this one coming? All right, Dan hooks up with some dope. We're going to have to drug her. Thank you, my dude. Yeah, she ain't even eating that one, is she? She don't like that. She don't like this one either. Just yellow. Come you're going to be the first real tame for, you know, what will be sometime later a base here. There you go, my dude. Woohoo! Good. We're happy about it. Here. Load the harpoon gun. And then put the squatch in the pocket. You need to be ready. Come on, girl. I like taking forever. All right, you got one more bite and you're good. All right, so there's our female. We'll continue flying around, see if we can find a max level one. Oh, let's go down here and kill this one I put to sleep. Your tainment efficiency just dropped to nothing. Look, that was so low level, I didn't even get their Xenosaur claws out of it. Nothing else that we need around in here. Of course, they didn't need to squatch either. I know you, you guys are saying that, but you know it's a squatch. I mean, who doesn't who need who doesn't need squatch? You know they passively harvest fiber like it ain't nobody's business. So and you never have enough fiber. Of course, I have a vault full of fiber and a couple of <laughs> a couple of moose chops full of fiber. Come on, Earl. I don't want to have to drug you again. Just eat. All right. That was close. Close to having to drug her again. I'm 
But yeah, that's going to be a good breeder. Good breeder. You're not bad at 8,000 base health. 8,300. Melee's a little weak. But maybe one of our males has better melee. But yeah, there we go. That's what we came here for. Yep, now we need to hit the water again and do the whole Bacillosaurus thing. See if we can get some more of those. A better one, but we're going to hit the water in a Bacillosaurus. I want to come here to Therry Hunt as opposed to continuing to do it on Belgaro because... I mean, Therry spawn pretty much all over the map here. Very few places you're not going to find a Therizinosaur. I mean, Redwoods, Swamp, Greenlands, even uh, the very far snow. I don't think I've ever seen one. What is that? All right, it's not the unicorn. I don't think I've seen one in the very far north, but everywhere else I have. Carnivore Island. Haven't seen one on Carnivore Island or Herbivore Island. But the bulk of the map, they spawn everywhere. So you have a lot of opportunities. You know, I've noticed on Belgaro, they only spawn in that one little short section. And that whole area sucks hunting in. Because it's just a bunch of up and down really short paths going up mountainsides. And it's heavily wooded, so, I mean, you could walk right by one. If you weren't looking that direction right at it, you wouldn't even know it. But that's why we came back here. Just to increase the opportunity of finding one. What level is that Quetzal? 190. I got you beat. A max level of anything we want. I brought plenty of kibble. I ain't afraid to use it. Fast, nothing we want over here anyway. <laughs> but we're just going to continue to look around, get back to our little hole. And then maybe transfer over to the other server and get to breeding these breeding this young lady. I mean, we'll get some levels up breeding, but you know we do better with a baseline three hundred, obviously. So we're not going to rule out the and 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 stop the hunt. Like I said, I've killed a bunch of them. And I'll kill a bunch more. But at least we got one we can work with. But if I see anything, I'll let y'all know. Wish me luck. Okay, well here we are after a considerable amount of swimming around. And then we have a 230 male, which is awesome. So we're going to get rid of all of the manas, of course, first. And then the megalodons. And then we'll tame her up, him up. We've been just out here swimming around leveling up. You know how it goes. All right, we should be able to get our first feed in. All right, this is going to take a while. 
but time's cheap. Look, I just really like that view. We have an interloper. Still haven't run into a, a max level Megalodon. Kind of shitty, but we'll just get that in Valguero. I'm going to get this Bacillosaurus and then head back to Valguero <clears throat> and then breed these two because that's, well, I may swim around just a little bit more, but you know, this one's not going to be, it's not a bad set. Not a bad set at all. So I guess, you know, I'll see you guys in a little while. Well, it's going to be a long while because I mean, what is it? 25, I got to feed it five times. It's going to be a fat minute. So, see you after a while. Okay, folks. I put out a female 290 pleasy. So, we got Nessie. Had to use my berry to do it. Of course. That's okay. My berry was happy to to oblige. But yeah, figured, you know, why not? I mean, I didn't, what do you really use them for? Really use them for much and nothing. Um, I know they don't really like that kibble, obviously. Try some purple on them. Maybe a chunk of teal. Then we can throw some of that prime meat, this prime fish meat that's about to spoil in there. I did shoot her one too many times. Um, what can you do? But still 290, right? So. <coughs> Excuse me again. Should still be fun riding around in the water. They, they move like fast as shit. Yeah, pleasies can flat get down the road. Whoa, in the water, so to speak. Only 20%, huh? Come on, really like something I got. Maybe it's just regular prime meat. Probably has some regular prime meat on here on this dude. I've been killing like freaking everything. Let's see. Yeah, we got some regular prime meat. More prime fish meat. Maybe I'd tame up with hatchets. <laughs> Something's bound to. Yellow kibble's only giving it just like ten percent. So that's going to be expensive for a dinosaur you don't use. Maybe it'll dig just regular prime meat, though. You never know. I think I'm, I like may have tamed like three pleasies the whole time I've played Ark. That was only because they were max level tames at the time. And this thing at 89% lost like, I don't know, 20 levels. Well, no, not quite 20. See, only 10 more percent. Yeah, so just a yellow kibble tame. Doesn't want to eat anything else. I believe it'll eat anything else. We just got to give it the option to eat everything else. But really, I mean, I got the kibble, so why not?
So yeah, we're gonna have a really high level pleasey. I'm digging it. Hopefully it's like some like cool color. Kind of hard to tell in this water. And my other gas mask just broke, so I can't tell you. We'll find out when we get at home. And I will see you guys back there. Y'all take it easy. Okay, my people, this is just a little short segment here. Um, because I realize, you know, like, not everybody plays on clusters. And I want to cover transferring from server to server if you do play on a, on a cluster. Now, first thing you got to do is, like, come to the obelisk, right? And you got to make sure it's clean. So that you can transfer uninterrupted. Like this dire bear, I'm afraid yeah, she's gonna have to go. So we'll just deal with her real quick. Alright, now I have a bunch of stuff that I'm gonna transfer. I'm transferring, you know, from Velgaro to the island. And I built a bunch of base making materials to take with me over there. Well, really, not like a bunch, but some. You'll see. All right, so... What do I got on me? I got enough on me to show you. All right, so just access the inventory. Now, if you're going to transfer stuff, like, see all this crap that's on here? This won't show up on the island. But say we take, like, 400 oil with us. Go to the Arc Data tab up here, and that's where you want to put everything you're transferring. And you got to make sure because, like, it's not unheard of that, you know, you you forget to go back to that tab and you just start shoving shit onto here, right? So you'll, you'll want to make sure you, if, if you got more stuff to stick on there, make sure you transfer it on the ARC data. make sure I get everything I need on there all at once You only have so many slots. You only got 50 slots to transfer crap. And if you notice, the, the countdown's on. I have 24 hours to transfer servers and bring all this crap with. All right, now I'm not going to be an idiot this time. And forget Dan the man. You would be amazed... And how many times either myself or my wife or one of my boys have transferred servers and left their shoulder pet right here at the obelisk. I did it just the last time. Hang on. I'm recording here. I did it just the last time I did this. So I'm not doing it now. So just lonely ass old me right here. No shoulder pet. All right, now it's time for me to transfer to the server. Down here where it says travel to another server. Just click on that, son, bitch. 
Click on Hammerland Island. And then transfer. And if all goes well, you will pop up with the bed location to transfer to. If you if if you're transferring to a current server, now Bob, when you and Riker come over, you're not going to have bed location. So you'll just transfer in down here, like South Zone One, and then you'll fly up to the Green Ob because I have to make a tribe over here for you. here we are home again home again on this you know ish home that we have going on here but this isn't where we're gonna stay um i'm moving on up going up to the green obelisk ah man i need to turn all this crap off i hate this new survivor crap I was going to check and see. Right. I didn't leave my dinosaurs here. I couldn't remember if I left my thylacolio and baryonyx here from when I was here before. Well, obviously I did not. So I'm going to pack up everything here because this is just where I wanted to start out here and until I got the stuff to make a base. And I'm going to go up to the green knob. I might bring y'all back up there. I'm not going to build anything fancy. These are just spawn points. Because all I'm going to do is come over here. I want to have a place where I can repair stuff. And and spawn if I die. But I'll show y'all that here in a little while. Hey, check it out, my people. I just decided before I left here. To go ahead and see if I could see a... Megalania and look what I saw I don't remember if my other one was a male or a female but this one is a 270 female so we can hope it's a male and I just got an awesome breeding pair of Megalania Come on, hit it. Go to sleep. Whatever that was. Finally, jeez. Yes, yeah, 270 female. I'm hoping that my other one's a male, but I'm almost betting it's a female. But I figure I'll run down in here real quick because there's another spawn point. Let's see if I can get any love. right up here but I'm not seeing anything
Oh, well, we can hope. In the meantime, we'll go back there and finish getting that one. There's some high level something in the water. I'm going to bet it wants to eat me. So, yeah, I'm not going to find out right now. <clears throat> didn't bring a whole lot of kibble with me because I was really just coming over here to do a little bit of base building as you guys have heard you know baby's awake so well come on something give it more than 11 percent Anyway, so I'm not going to have a whole lot of time to record, but, you know, if I do run into more interesting stuff, I will bring you guys in. See you after a while. Hey, check this shit out. I haven't even left yet. And got a female Meglania right there. A 180. And over here, this green weenie. That's a male 270. I even know they spawned here. I'd never seen them here before, but there's still a 300 head in here somewhere. And I'm thinking it's going to be a fish, like a piranha or something in water. So they're just going to kill a bunch of sarco down there. But I figured I'd check it out anyway. And and I happen to see them some bitches up there. I've never even seen them spawn up there, but you know what? I'm digging it. Because this one's coming home with me. It doesn't know it yet. Papa, Papa, uh. Wait. Yeah, I see that, sweetheart. I like it. Do you? No. You don't like it? Seventy hit the water. Uh, I'm trying to record here. Why isn't it thing killing it? It's only a 180. Oh, this is gonna suck. They're gonna, I'm gonna have to like kill a whole bunch of fucking piranha in hopes of getting this Meglania. Come on, my dude. Fucking swim over yonder. Okay, let's fight. Fucking everything in here. Just a bunch of piranha and shit in here. Yeah, they're pretty though, ain't they?
they can make tighter laps than my thylacolio can. I need them to all be dead. I need me to not be. Where'd he go? That Megalani is gonna get over there and drown. How retarded is that? Dude, you can't breathe underwater. What the hell? All right, let's get rid of a lot of this weight. Big lady, I think it's safe. I will kill that motherfucker in the water. I don't give a shit. I mean, if I can't have it, ain't nobody having it kind of guy. Is it unconscious? No. This is a lot more complicated than it should be. I know I should have netted it or something, huh? Are you going to go to sleep, dude? Oh, that's going to kill it. That's so retarded. Oh, well, that was a missed opportunity, y'all. There'll be more. I still got something that's a level 300 up in here, though. And I don't know what it is, because I've, like, killed everything. I mean, you just seen me in the water there. that explore note. I wonder what it could be. There's not a dung beetle stuck anywhere that I can see.
Yeah, I got nothing, people. All right, well, going to the green obelisk now. I'm a little upset. I'm not gonna lie. Fucking Megalania. Just a little upsetting. It was a 270 male. Now I'm probably only gonna see like level 30s and level 28s and shit. And I've had nothing but problems out of this G portal server for a week. That's why it's taking me so long to put this video out. Because it's just been a freaking nightmare of not being able to launch this server. I have not been a happy customer. I have voiced my displeasure on more than one occasion. So I can't just shut it down and keep rebooting it, you know, like I normally would because I can't trust it to come back online. I've had pretty much a year's worth of relatively flawless service from G Portal with my with my Valheim server and my Arc servers. But ever since Enshrouded came out, uh, they're, they've overtaxed their resources, I do believe. And really put a strain on what they had. And it's compromised my ability to, to make videos because I've needed to make this uh, transfer the art video. And I'm going to make a video on all of the boss or all of the, all of the caves here again. I know I have a run through on meaty with all of them individually, but I'm just going to put them all in one video where I'm just running all of the caves and it may be today. It may be tomorrow when I make that video, but it's just going to be one video of all the Island cave locations and, and me running them. So expect that it's going to be a pretty fucking long video because as most of you should be aware, Cave of the Strong is not a 10 minute run. So it's going to take a minute to complete that one. But I'll edit as much of it as I can to make it as short as possible for you guys. Hey, Quetzal. Level 100. But yeah, that'll be coming out um, probably next week. Because if I don't do it today, I almost definitely will do it tomorrow. And if not, then damn sure Saturday night. Um, Saturday night, if, if I wait till Saturday night, it'll be me and my wife running them. And maybe Bobby and his boy. Just run through there, just wreaking havoc. But yeah, we're not going to build much of a base here. I might as well just run my mouth until I get up here. Um, I'm not going to build a great big huge base here. I just, I need a base that's going to, uh, where I can repair shit. You know, because I got a, a bunch of scuba that I got to be doing. There's pretty Tapahara. Of course, it's level 40. Uh, this will still have the remnants of the Christmas event dinos. Although the Christmas event is well and truly over. I had originally considered building right here because this is one of my favorite places to build on this map. But I think this time, just for expediency's sake, I'm going to try building right here in this gap, right where this over raptor's running. I'm going to behemoth gate here and behemoth gate here and just have this be the base.
just lay foundations, put a couple of behemoth gates down, and pop down all the crap that are brought over to transfer. So now we just have to do the opposite. Remember, we had 24 hours. It's only been like a few minutes. So go to arc data, and there's all the stuff we transferred. And just pop it out. It won't let you transfer all. At least it never used to. Yeah, see, transfer all. That shit don't work. But you can encumber the shit out of yourself standing here. Like I just did. So keep an eye out for that. Yeah, I'm still encumbered. Am I, I'm even too encumbered to walk still. Okay, so I'm going to get to laying some stuff out over here. Um, I'll show you. I'll, I'll, I'll keep the recording software up just to show you guys the end of it. It's not going to be a press, but it's going to be a big box right there. Like I said, I'm going to behemoth gate it, ceiling tile it, foundation it, and I'm going to be good. So, see y'all in a little bit. All right, folks. Well, this is what we got. I got a little bit left to, left to fill in like right in there and it's just for sh for sheer aesthetics you know you see that one little row right there and maybe fill it in over there or come down with it or some shit maybe put some walls up and right there on that side but just a spawn point right i don't want anything fancy here i don't need anything fancy here I'm going to be on this server for like three fucking days. Okay, it's going to be like no time. I just need repair stations. Um, I got four forges going. Did one metal run over there. If you don't know where the metal is here, then you should watch my meaty bits playthrough. Look, plug in my own videos. I'm fucking getting good at this shit. Okay, got the generator. You know, the S plus and the regular crafting station there, the smithy. And then I got the cryo fridge. The fabricator and the chem station and a regular fridge right all we need to do is be able to repair our shit here okay i'm gonna have to have repair some scuba and repair gas mask because i got the gas mask cave to run into you know um i got the thyla here and the construction crew of course got the ever-present squatch just because it wouldn't be an ever-present squatch if it wasn't present would it so yeah this is just a place to touch base a place to spawn in on this map and um to bring shit right I and mean, i've been doing some killing right so we got some shit i gotta pull some shit off the bird by the way You know, just in the course of playing the game, you do plenty of killing. So, I'm, I may have more than enough of almost everything. You know, I gotta get a couple more Sarko skins. I know, I'm pretty sure I need five of fucking everything in order on the beta. Let's go check real quick, just for shits and grins. Just because it should be at the back of the, 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 at the end of this video. Because the next video is gonna be cave running. And, well, it's going to have to be postponed a little bit, I'm afraid, because, yeah, I just got informed this morning that I'm working Saturday. So, I was going to do it Saturday night. Looks like that ain't going to fucking happen. All right, we're looking for the blue ones. Here we go. Uh, Five Argent Talons. Yeah, looks like five of everything. I got Aloe Brains. Oh, I need a Giga Heart. I'm going to have to bring something over to kill some Giga with. All right. Time more for Don's. Here we come. So we got to kill a Giga. And we'll run Beta on the Dragon. Um, I got to kill a Squid. 
get the tooth with tooth of Santa Claus. What's beta monkey? Anything outstanding? Nope, that's what I need the thylacolio hooks for. We're one megalodon tooth away. I think I got the megalania toxin and the theories and the spino. I haven't killed a single thylacolio on the island yet though, so we gotta wait on that. Argent talons are easy to come by. Titanobo venom, sauropod vertebrae, they're same. This one's some Rex arms are not hard to come across. Now there are UD lungs. Just got to go up north. So, yeah, it won't, you know, three or four days max. Uh, maybe a, a week at the most is what I'll be here. And then I'm going to box this place up and cryo all these dinos and take them to scorched earth. That's just the way of it. Well, I'll take him back to Velgaro first. And and then I'll delete this server and open one on Scorched Earth. That's the way it's gonna be. And yeah, so I don't I don't need anything fancy here. I was gonna fill in that hole up there, but you know what? I kinda like being able to fly my bird up in and out without having to open the fun gate. I don't even know if I'll finish these walls over here. It's just because I, I honestly, I just don't give a shit. This place is, is temporary at best. All I needed it was a place to be able to spawn in, grab a dino and go running. And a place for my tribe mates to spawn in when they come to this server to join me for the boss fights. So, yeah, that's where we're at, my peoples. Sorry, I haven't put out a video. I've been working a bunch and I got a bunch of bullshit on my gourd. Yeah, okay, um, I'm gonna make some hard truth. Uh, I've been meaning to like every fucking day, but you know what? I, I just goddamn can't. I just fucking life gets in the way. That's, that's life's job is to get in the fucking way. So, um, yeah, some of my hard truth is gonna deal with the shit that's been on my mind. Uh, some of it's just going to be shit that I've I've already dealt with and, you know, just want to pass on. But I hope you all enjoy the video. I, I know it's, there's not really a whole lot going on in it, but there's a bunch of information. And setting it up for the beginning of this fucking run, right? It's pretty, I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. Pretty excited about being able to, to jump in here. I did get a mod that lets me transfer element. So my element's not going to be wasted here. I'm going to like run the bosses, gather the element, and then shag ass, transfer it to Vulgaro. So fucking Oha, my peoples. I hope it works. I've never used the fucking element transfer mod before. So I hope it works out. And oh, my element's just not going to get deleted with the server. But we'll see. Um, next video, like I said, going to be going to be cave runs. I'm going to do everyone on the island on one video. Might take me a week to finish it all, but I'll get that video out to you. And then the video after that, my people's going to be boss run. Going to beta boss run this island. Oha, wish me the best. I wish you guys the best. And we'll see you in the next video.